Hi, this is Chris Gould with Geeks on Tour. And if you're a traveler like I am, you're always hearing about places that you say, I want to go there someday. How do you remember those places? In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Google Maps to save those places so you can see them later. First, I want to show you on the computer and then on the phone. So on a computer browser, you go to maps.google.com and make sure that you are signed in with your account. You'll see your account button, your little face in the upper right hand corner. Now, the first thing is to find a place that you want to go. So I have a friend who is hooked on the show Diners, Drive-Ins, and Dives, and she says if we're ever in Wyoming, we need to go to Nora's Fish Creek Inn in Wyoming. So I find that, and the panel that opens up on the left has this little button to save. And I can, there's several different lists, but I just like to put things in want to go. What happens then is it gets this little green flag. And next time we are driving through Wyoming, I'll be definitely looking at my Google Maps and I'll see that little green flag, wonder what it is, and I can click on it and see. I can even add a note. In Saved and Want to Go, I can add a note, and then next time I will, I click on it, I will see that note. Now, if you zoom out, you'll see that I have done this for several places. And something to be aware of is they appear or disappear depending on how much you are zoomed in or zoomed out. So if you want to make sure you're seeing all your places, just zoom in a bit and zoom out and they will come into view. If they're cluttering up your screen and you want to make them disappear, you can do that too. Over on the menu and your places, it's under lists and want to go, the three dots, and hide on your map, and they're gone. Want them back, click the three dots, and show on your map. Now let me show you on the phone. On a phone, either Android or iPhone, this happens to be a Samsung, go to the Google Maps app. And first I want to show you that I can see that place that I just added. So I find Wyoming. And there is a green flag that is Nora's Fish Creek Inn. And if I scroll up, I will see the note that I wrote on it. Now let's add another one. I was talking to a friend. They said, if you're ever in Spain, you need to go to Montserrat. And I think that sounds like a great idea. I hope to be in Spain sometime. And there is Montserrat on the phone. The way you save it is down at the bottom. There is this save button. And then which list do you want to save it in? I'm going to put it in want to go. And I'm going to add a note. And done. And same thing. You zoom out to see all of your want to go and you can zoom in and they will appear and disappear as you as you do that and once again if they are cluttering up your screen the way you turn them off is where it with none of them selected with nothing up in the search bar you can tap on saved Scroll down till you see the want to go, three dots, and hide on your map. Now you go back to explore, and the green flags are gone. There are others because those are other lists. I want them back. I tap on saved, scroll down, and three dots, and show on your map, and then explore. If you use Google Maps, this is a way that you will be sure to remember some place that you wanted to go. 